So this question, um, so preceding this question, there's a, a quite a bit of information. We have this graph here, so I'm going to call this a diagram question to start. There might be some other strategies here. But initially, right, the graph kind of stands out. We see the title of the graph here says Columbia River Velocity versus Depth, um, where the y-axis is velocity, the x-axis is the depth. So it looks like as the depth gets higher, right, so as we get deeper, the velocity is decreasing. And it looks like we have a line of best fit here with points all around that line. Let's clean this up so I don't get confused by my points versus the points from the question. So the information says at a certain location on the Columbia River, the velocity of the water flow at different depths was measured. The scatter plot shown gives 11 measurements of the velocity V in feet per second of the water at various depths D in feet. A line of best fit for the data is also shown. Okay, so pretty much what we expected um, by just looking at it. Question 37 says, according to the line of best fit, what is the predicted velocity of the water flow in feet per second at a depth of four feet? Okay, so very simple question. We go to a depth of four feet, which is here. Because we're looking for the predicted velocity, not the actual velocity at that depth, but the predicted velocity, we just go up to the graph and see, well, where does the graph match up with a depth of four? It's right here. And that is core, that corresponds with 1.2 feet per second for velocity. So our answer here must be 1.2.